hello guys welcome back to my channel in this session i'm just going to tell you how you can download install and configure mysql workbench on your mac having m1 or m2 chip so in order to install the mysql workbench first of all we have to download a file so we have to go to the favorite browser and you can just type download mysql workbench the very first link that will be appearing from dev.mysql.com you can click on that link and then over here you have to select a mac os and yeah so very first option that is coming mac os arm 64 bit dmg archive you can click on download on this and then you have to click on uh, click on no thanks just start my download so once you click on this particular link it will start downloading the mysql workbench file but in order to save the time i have already downloaded this file so let me just quickly go to the desktop and over here we have uh, like we have this particular file now before moving forward just make sure that we have already installed mysql server on your machine so because if we have installed that mysql server then only we will be able to use the workbench otherwise there will be no any use so if you are not if, if you have not installed this mysql server you can just check out the link which is given in the description box also you can just uh, click on this uh, right hand side corner and if you have already installed then you can just double click on this particular file and then you have to like drag this mysql workbench to the application uh, folder and we have to just wait till it will copy the uh, file which which are required so once copy is done then what we have to do we have to go to the applications folder and then over here you will be able to see uh my sql workbench so we can just uh, open it by double clicking on it and then it will ask whether do you want to open this so yes i just want to open it so let me click on this and then we will get this particular window now as we have already installed my sql server on our local we can directly use this workbench to connect to our local so we can double click on this particular and then over here what it is asking it is asking the password which we have used to set up the mysql server so if you remember uh, like while installing the mysql server we have used a uh, root password so we have to use the root user password over here in order to connect so let me just click on ok and over here it is asking like some in incompatible um, versions so i just don't want to worry about it as of now so i'll just click on continue anyway and then yes uh, we will be able to continue to our local host now over here uh, we can just go to the schemas and maybe we can just try to create one new schema which is uh, let's suppose test we can click on apply then click on apply again and we can just close it now if you just run the query like show databases something like this then you will be able to see the newly created databases also and there are few more databases which we get when we install the mysql server but whatever database you have just created we are able to see that database over here so this is how we can install we can download install and configure our mysql work workbench on our mac machine having m1 or m2 chip if you still have any questions let me know into a comment section and i will try my best to help you out in that case i hope you enjoyed this session i'll see you in the next session